Hi everyone, welcome to Storytime at Mead County Library. Today's story is Kiss the Crocodile. It is written by Sean Taylor and illustrated by Ben Mantle. And it is published by Walker Books. Who would be brave enough to kiss a crocodile, I wonder? Let's find out. Look at the fun these three are having. I know a game, says Monkey. Let's all play Stick Splash. Plish, plash, plush. Anteater says, I know another game. Let's all play Scary Monsters. Tortoise says, Let's all play Silly Dancing now. Uppity, hippity, hop, hop. Monkey's dance is so silly, she almost falls in the mud hole and... Look who's there! It's little crocodile with his big crocodile mum. Anteater whispers. Those are sharp claws. Tortoise whispers. What a lot of teeth. Monkey whispers. Let's keep back. But little crocodile spots them. His mum says, you can play a game we like if you want. It's called Kiss the Crocodile. Little crocodile really wants them to play. He says, I lie here asleep and you mustn't wake me up. But you have to be brave enough to kiss the crocodile. Monkey says, okay. I'm brave enough. I bet you can. I bet I can actually be brave enough first, says Aunt Eater. I bet maybe you can't, says Monkey. But Aunt Eater checks to make sure little crocodile looks asleep. Then she tiptoes over ever so very quietly. She reaches down even more ever so very quietly. And she kisses the crocodile. Little crocodile gives a small snort, but he doesn't wake up. Anteater asks, who's brave enough to kiss the crocodile next? Tortoise thinks. Then he says, me. He checks to make sure little crocodile still looks asleep. He walks over very very, very, very slowly. He reaches his lips up even more very, very, very slowly and schmitch kisses the crocodile. Little crocodile moves an eyelid but he doesn't wake up. Tortoise says, how about you monkey? Okay, says Monkey. But she doesn't move. You said you were brave enough, Anteater tells her. I know, said Monkey. And she goes a little bit. But then she comes back. It's only a game, whispers Anteater. And Tortoise says, kiss the crocodile. So Monkey scampers quickly across. She swings down in a hurry, kisses the crocodile, schmack, and little crocodile wakes up. Monkey skids and scurries, but little crocodile skids and scurries faster. So Monkey turns around and she says, we were only playing the game you liked. What happens now? And little crocodile says, Now, can I play a game you like? So he does. And look at the fun these four are having. They play stick splash. And guess who makes the biggest splash? Blush! 
They play scary monsters. And guess who's the scariest? Knack, knack, knack. They play silly dancing. And guess who's the silliest dancer? Hippity, uppity, bippity, boppity. Dippity, doppity, do. Then little crocodile says, I know another game. Let's all play. Kiss the monkey. All right, monkey lass, if you're brave enough. And mm, 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 they're all very brave. And look at the great friends these four are now. The end. Hope you enjoyed our story today. Join us again soon for story time. Bye.